Hello, so I am here to do another plan with me. This one is gonna be a little bit different. So this is actually the first video of my recipe plan with me series. So to start out, I have a lot of recipes that I need to put into my recipe books. So I have been doing the Every Plate and the HelloFresh when I can find like really good deals. They have a lot of like really good recipes and it's kind of different things that we don't wouldn't normally think of. Um, and the recipe that I'm gonna be doing today to put into my, my classic um, recipe organizer is the Homestyle Chicken and Biscuit Pot Pie. This is one of my favorite recipes. Um, my son likes it, which makes me happy. So yeah, this is what I'm going to be um, doing today. And I already have my stickers picked out. Um, I kind of just have like some food, some little decoration, little fun things, and then all of the functional stickers. And these came from the recipe. Um, these ones came out in 2019. And then the food one and the food two. I couldn't tell you what came from what, sorry. Now, to kind of help you understand why I'm doing this. So I originally bought the mini recipe organizer. I've used it some. Um, you know, I've got I've got some dishes in here. Um, you know, just just like I'm I'm trying to add to it. And then I think the dessert I have the most. Um, but yeah, so that's kind of what I've got so far. And as I was getting all of these recipes, I kind of realized that some of these have it, they're too much for the small book. Um, like, I don't want a recipe to take one page and then take two pages. I want it just to be on just one page because as you're cooking, you don't want to be flipping back and forth. So I ended up purchasing the classic size um, recipe organizer. It was actually on the Happy Planner site for 10 bucks. So I went ahead and purchased it so I can kind of use it for like my bigger recipes. And eventually, I'm going to get some rose gold metal discs. So in that way, I can have it match um, the rose gold metal discs that I put on my mini size planner. Hopefully, I can find them. Like, that's kind of my plan. So we are going to start. So this is considered a main dish. So I'm going to pull from the main dish. Um, I'm kind of thinking that... What I'm gonna do is probably for like ease of the videos, this is obviously gonna kind of be out of sight. Um, I'm going to do the ingredients first, and then I'm gonna kind of put down the numbers for the directions, you know, um, put what it is. I might use alphabet stickers for that. I, I probably not, because that's actually, it's gonna get, use a lot of alphabet stickers. Um, and I think as I'm writing it, I'm probably going to pop in some music and speed up the volume or speed up the, um, the video. That way you don't really have to just kind of sit here and just watch me write. So let me actually want to get, um, I have certain pens that I like to use for certain things. I'm going to use these two. Okay, I'm not going to use that one. So this, I'm going to use the Sharpie pen for the title. And I'm going to use my .38. This is my little cat pen. I'm going to use this for the actual writing. So let's get started. Um, so what I always like to do is like, I don't, I don't use like a lot of decoration in this. Um, I'm going to, you know, kind of use some just because it's fun. But I think for the most part, it's going to be very, very functional. Um, so I, this is kind of like what I'm using for um, the temperature that the oven has to be set to. Okay. 
Okay, um, I'm gonna do something up here, but what I think I'm gonna do, this is kind of where I'm gonna bring in like a couple of the stickers. Um, I just wanna kind of have like little bits of food around, just because it's cute. Hopefully that won't cut into, um, I, like, I think I'm really gonna have to, because this is the recipe and I think I'm gonna have to really condense it down to make sure that it fits. So, and actually, I'm also going to condense down the title too. I don't need to know that it is a home style. I just need to know that it is this. And then I'm gonna put this yum right over there because this is one of my favorite recipes. Um, I always like to have in this little sticker on all of my recipe pages somewhere. So I'm just gonna put that right there. And I am actually think I'm gonna put this right here. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with the ingredients. This has a lot of, of ingredients. And this is where my EK Tools craft tweezers come in. So all of these are for the ingredients. I think I've got like 10 main ingredients. And then, uh, so the way that HelloFresh and Every Plate and like all those meal kits, they basically divide it into the ingredients that they send you. And then they provide you with a list of other ingredients that you're gonna need that you basically have to have on hand. So I have these green dots for, oh, and by the way, I didn't know that this page was gonna be green before I pulled the stickers, or else I would have pulled a different color. I'm not gonna go back and pick up new stickers for that, that's not a big deal to me. But anyways, so the green dots are for the main ingredients, and the rose gold are for the extra three ingredients, kind of like the ones that like the salt and pepper and the oil and butter and, you know, things that you're always going to have on hand as a staple anyways. And also, okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and write down the ingredients. All right, and then I'm gonna, I have this little salt and pepper sticker, so I thought it'd be kind of fun to just use those. And normally I like to kind of use like more food stickers to go along with the recipe that I'm making. Um, unfortunately, I really didn't have much options for this recipe. Okay, now, so prep time. Um, prep time and everything is on the recipe, which is really nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that in. And let's go ahead and start the recipe. Um, oh, and this serves two people. All right. So this is kind of going to be where I think I'm going to have to write as I, I'm going to have to write as I kind of put down the stickers. So I'm just going to go ahead, pop in some music, speed it up. Um, future videos, you might see me write and I might talk as I write, but I think for this one, I'm just going to go ahead and speed it up.
I'll show you what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna take this one. I need my scissors. <clears throat> I'm just gonna cut off the, that. Um, and this one. <sighs> oh no, okay, hold on. I'm gonna move this down. <laughs> Let's see how well it works. Wax paper, don't fail me now. I may have to get another sticker. Um, I may have to get another sticker. Okay, let's see. I'm actually gonna move this down just a little bit down here. That's fine. Because now I wanna just kind of put this right here. So there we go. So I did it very, <laughs> I did a very condensed version of the recipe just because of the fact that, you know, this is kind of going to be a recipe book that's going to, you know, either stay, it's going to stay in my family. And um, so it's kind of for somebody who has um, like basic knowledge about cooking and kind of knows you know like if I don't directly say um it, you know like part of the recipe says spoon into shallow bowls or plates and serve you don't need to I don't need to put that in the recipe um it says like transfer chicken to plate well I said move chicken to plate and cook veggies in a drizzle oil so they're gonna know use the same pan don't get a don't get a new pan um Let's see, I'm trying to think. Yeah, um, you know, it's just, it's just, it's gonna be like base. They're, they're gonna know the basics, so I'm not, I'm not gonna have to spell out every little thing. Okay, so there we go. Thank you for joining me. Um, I hope you really enjoyed this. I cannot wait to do more. And actually, let me put this back in my planner. So there we go, my very first recipe in my classic size organizer. I can't wait to fill this up and I have these more, this more, many more recipes and I have one more, actually there's already off to the side that I'm gonna record um, later this week. But yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this. I can now officially close this out and I don't have to worry about needing that around anymore. And I cannot wait to have all of these in my recipe organizer. So again, thank you so much for joining me. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell if you wanna get notifications about other videos when I post them. Have a good day, guys. Bye.